Good morning, Colonel Bai. It's Thursday, March 11th. I'm Aziz. And I'm Samia. And, and here, here are your, your morning, morning announcements. CP Business Solutions is launching the Elizabeth Priestman Spirit of Giving Bursary, which awards students for their positive impact on their peers and more. If you're interested, email Ms. Battery for more info. The Vanier Community Service Center, alongside the London Pearson Community and Carleton University, are organizing a table discussion for youth. Well, they'll discuss many of the themes that came out of the International Convention for Children's Rights. This will happen on March 20th from 1 to 4. You have the option of getting $20 just to participate, and an extra $10 to refer a friend to participate as well. Or you can take this as volunteer hours. If you're interested, head over to the Cool Opportunities link under the CV Guidance webpage. Grad photos are happening and they're starting on March 17th. Visit our CV website under News to book your appointment. Speaking of which, let's go check out an ad on that. Make sure to book your appointments, Cougars. As part of the hashtag Choose to Challenge campaign, CV's Feminism Club is joining CV's Black Excellence Club, Olive Branch Club, and Safe Club in creating their own campaign. To check it out, visit any of their Instagrams. This month's video contest is CV Spring Break. Send a video of your spring break activity in the snow to the Studco Instagram page for a chance to win prizes, points for your grade, and a chance to have it aired on Cougar Vision. Want to be part of the student council next year? Applications to be CB student senator are up on our CB website and they're due to Mr. Baird by March 15th. We got the chance to check out Joyce Liu, a CB student who's also a student trustee in the OCDSB. Let's go see what she had to say. Hi, my name is Joy. I'm in grade 12. I work as a student trustee on the school board this year and um, last year worked as our school student senator. So the student senator application also doubles as our school student trustee candidate application. So if you're interested in either of these two roles, um, please apply. So what is a student trustee? Um, as a student trustee, there are two student trustees who represent 75,000 students on the board of trustees. Um, you attend a couple different uh, meetings on a monthly basis and you work on issues like um, like the development of human rights policy or the review of the of police involvement in schools. Um, so there's some of these big issues and you can also further your own advocacy goals. So for example, just this January, myself and the other student trustee Charles passed a motion mandating the school board to provide free period products in school washrooms um, by like September 2022. So, that's an example of what you get to do as student trustee, and you also chair student senate. So now, what is student senate and what is a student senator? Um, so as student senator, you'll get to represent CB at monthly meetings where you have senior school board staff coming in to ask, student, ask for student feedback on issues like mental health and issues like equity. Um, so you get to provide feedback on behalf of the school, and you also um, get to work on specific, like student senate projects. So for example, this year we are working to get um, suicide intervention training in high schools, kind of similar to how you sort of have like self-defense training in a select few high schools right now. Um, so that's just kind of an overview of these two roles. These like, I love, I really love my student senator job this year. I really love my student trustee job this year. There are so many cool things that I don't even have the time to mention right here. Um, so if you're interested and if you have any questions, please email me joy.liu at ocdsb.ca and I'm really happy to chat. Um, and so like, please apply and good luck. Thank you, Joy, and make sure to apply Cougars. Are you interested in following a post-secondary pathway in the STEM field? If so, there will be a virtual presentation today at 2.15 on this. If you're interested, head over to the Cool Opportunities link under the CV Guidance webpage. Hey Nazif, how was your test the other day? Um, uh, I don't really want to talk about it, but let's go see what happened. All right, everybody, the test will start in one minute, so get yourselves prepared. You will have exactly one hour to write the test. 
Judging by the position of my camera and Mr. Docksetter's ever so sinister glare on our tests, he's planning on making sure none of us cheat on our tests. With the whole view of our tables, it'd be very easy to be caught lacking. But it won't be that easy with me, Mr. Docksetter. <laughs> I've set things up so I'll look totally innocent. Mr. Docksetter is aware of our surroundings, but he sure isn't aware of what he can't see. I'll show you how it's done, Mr. Docksetter. <laughs> My plan is glorious! I'll be able to search up the answers to the test with my hidden phone. I'll write my answers with my right, and I'll search them up with my left. That's right, Mr. Dockstatter. You've been outsmarted. I'll take a potato chip and eat it. I can't wait to see your face when you return my test with a hundred... Uh, Tiff, you know that we can all hear you, right? I guess that's going to be one last test for me to mark, and another zero for you, Nazif. When will he ever learn? Remember, CV, don't be like Nazif and show your academic integrity. Yeah, I learned that the hard way. Anyways, that's all from us today, CB. To call her B at school. To call her A at home. Have, Have a, a talisman, talisman Thursday. Thursday.